Hi, Cyberspruce here, back with another Ordinal Markup video, episode 4, and I found out that um, the music is not copyrighted, so that's why I have it on now. So, it, it's, it's this thing from like one of Vsauce's videos. Um, but anyway, we can do our next factor shift, which I have no idea what this does. I think it unlocks a new mechanic, because I think, like, I've seen pictures of white game players, and they still have base 3. And I have enough ordinal points. Actually, I need to get this. There we go. And boom. I can, I can, I am back to base 10, but I have, I have a factor boost. Do I have any booster? I do have, I have one booster. Um, each factor is twice as powerful. Unlock auto clicker for maxing all. Ooh, I can do any, and there's a bunch of stuff here, which I don't need to. And there's an auto buyers, but I don't, I don't, it's tier two automation. I, I get it because this is like tier one automation. And tier two is going to be the next level. So I'm, I'm not sure what I should do. Each factor is best powerful. That could be really powerful. Um, infinity auto clicker. I don't really need that. And there's auto clicker for maxing all. I don't know what that does. I'm just gonna go here. Each factor is twice as powerful. I think that is the that is something I'm gonna need. And and right now it's just the same. I'm just gonna keep going for the required. I I need 200 ordinal points to do the first factor shift. I need capital mega capital mega plus one ordinal points to. Um, to do the next factor boost so i've actually i know the optimal strategy to get the first factor shift is and this is literally you don't go anywhere above omega times seven you just keep incrementing it like this and this gives you enough to gain 200 ordinal points and at, at the beginning it's gonna be this it's gonna be slower but once we have all the factors it's gonna be faster so here it is first factor shift again we only need 10 ordinal points, but we still need to get just the enough number to infinity. So this, this feels slow just because of the, the way, just, just because I, I it was so, so much bigger before and now we're, we're back here and, and I think, yeah, we're just going to go for 110 because that, that gives me some, that gives me the factor. So now it's times four, and then we can get this. So now we're already clicking four times per second. So there, there's it. I'm just gonna try to go for another 100 um, ordinal points, and we need we need what do we need for the next? We need a thousand. So so yeah. The, um, here's 100 ordinal points. Actually, I'm gonna do this because now we're clicking. Or we're only clicking six times per second. That, that's right. Um, so I'm just gonna keep doing this once we get 100 ordinal points that'll allow us to get um, this auto clicker so now it's gonna be almost completely automated I'm just gonna go, I'm gonna go for 200 here to try to get one more of the of the auto buyers for the for the successor to, to increase the ordinal by one because that's gonna double that speed so now we're clicking 12 times per second. It's pretty decent to get to the next factor shift. The next factor shift is at, um, I think it's a thousand ordinal points. Yeah, it's a thousand ordinal points. So it's a little bit of a grind, but it, I don't think it's too bad, especially considering we are already one third of the way there. And we, we even have, no, we only have 16 ordinal points. So all we have to do is just get to omega squared times nine and we'll get to the next We'll get to the next factor shift, and, I, and it's gonna be, and this booster is gonna be more powerful as we progress farther in. So, yeah, we're we're almost there now. We we need, need boom, one thousand ordinal points. Next factor shift, and again, it's a little bit slow in the beginning, but I'm just gonna get try to get. I, I think they're already like they're already doing it by ten, so I don't even really need another factor shift. Like it's all, it's they're just all being doubled, like by by default. I, I'm not even sure what, what this wording is here, but yeah, we're gonna go for 110 here. 
as, as usual because this will, this will allow me to do this and get this. So now we're clicking eight times per second, which means basically all we have to do is to spam this button and we'll be, we can get another 100, which I'm going to use for this. Now we're clicking twice as fast as before. We keep getting hundreds. I'm just going to wait until 200 here, which is going to be very powerful, allowing me to get this and that. And we need 10,000 or ordinal points for the next factor shift. So we're already clicking. We are clicking 24 times per second. It's pretty good, but I'm going to, as always, I'm going to want more. So I'm just going to go for 1,000 here, which is not even that bad. And... And now, I can't do any of this, so it's just getting the auto-clickers. Um, so, I get, I just, I just, I barely, I know, I only, I don't even need a thousand. I don't even know what I'm talking about. So what I'm going to need now is Omega to the fourth, which is going to take a little while. Actually, we're already a quarter of the way there, so it's not even going to take that much time. All we have to do is just wait a little bit. And we'll get there. We're halfway. And I'm gonna I'm trying to do this to speed it up slightly. I don't I don't think it's speeding up that much since we are clicking. Yeah, you know, oh, we already already have dynamic factors. I didn't even I didn't know that. We already had dynamic factors. So we're clicking a hundred times per second. So it's, it's not even it's not that slow. So here we go. One thousand ten thousand ordinal points. Another factor shift. We're at base seven. And beginning as always is slow hopefully I, th I think the max all could help with this beginning because this beginning is just slow so yeah. 110 ordinal points I, I always go for that and and once we actually get the first one of these it's it's just it's much faster like we are already clicking a hundred not hundred times we're clicking 16 times per second which is pretty good here and we can get 300 ordinal points right off the bat, which means I'm just gonna get. I'm actually gonna no, just do this. So now we're clicking 49 times per second. And we're gonna go for a thousand ordinal points here. That'll allow me to get this. Now we're now we're clicking even faster, and yeah, this is 350,000 ordinal points, which is a lot, unfortunately, but it's still manageable and yeah now we're click now we're clicking very fast it's enough for, to get 10,000 which is enough to start doing some of these so it's uh, the later game is much faster unfortunately the early game is a little bit slower we're, we're, yeah we're already like half no this is just gonna be to a hundred thousand so we I, I I'm thinking I can get farther than I actually am so well, at least here's a hundred thousand which will allow me to to about double my click speed and and then we need to get farther we need to get to Omega to the fifth times four almost so unfortunately that that's where we are so it looks like we have reached milestone 10 um, no we, we actually no we we've reached milestone 12 and so I've been upgraded in the second row let's see these upgrades while we're waiting actually we're not we're gonna be waiting for long because we're, we're literally almost there so yeah, there's there it is 350,000 ordinal points next factor shift our right, base six already this is going pretty fast so it's, it's interesting how the booster is the second prestige layer so I probably don't even need 110 but I, I guess it's easy to get that so that's what I do anyway and and we're already this <laughs> It's weird, it's just incrementing the number at this point until I actually start playing around with this. I'm, I'm just gonna go for a thousand here because there's really... I'm, I barely have to wait to get that thousand and this is gonna allow me to get just... It's gonna allow me to get so much. So, yeah, we're clicking 300, almost 300 times per second with... Like, without even trying. Like, we're... We're really getting farther in game so now we're yeah this is op this this is op that we are clicking so fast now we are already uh, he's gonna be omega to the omega which gives me a massive amount of ordinal points and it can be used for the factors and also for this so yeah now we're 
What do we? I don't even need no need for this. We need E12, which is gonna be doable here. It, it's gonna. It'll take a little bit of time, but not that much. So I'll just look at these upgrades. So yeah, these, these. It looks like these are just unlock the next mechanics. This is you gain five times as many ordinal points. That is OP. I'm gonna need that, and they're literally called called OP. Um, boosters t boost tier one and two automation by ten. So automation, it, it just says locked. It's only if you're past Psy of o capital Omega, and we're also we have enough ordinal points to do a factor shift. So we're already down to base five. It's pretty insane, and I'm. I may just go one more base before I end the episode, but that's, yeah, we're, we're multiplying the automation by 64, which means that, I, I you yeah, know, look at this, we're, it's going to be easy to get to 1,000 here, and that means I can do this, and 10,000 already, I just, I'm just going to be clicking max all here, because I, I barely need to do anything, I just, I can just get all this so much. I, I can get this just so easily now, and I can, I can max all here. And un unfortunately, what do we need? E21. So that actually may take a little bit of time. I can get some. Actually, I didn't even see that. I, I just missed an opportunity here. But yeah, now we're we're going really fast. I'm just gonna look at these. In 20 ordinal points per second. That could that's gonna be the beginnings. Base is always five. Well. At least, I'm, I'm guessing. I have no idea why. Why do these cost like very similar? But maybe seems like you can refund boosters in exchange for your factor shifts. So I mean, I I, I guess that that could be pretty powerful. But um, but at, at this point, it's it, I think it's better just to keep doing the builds that. I, I have here. I, I, I'm losing. I'm losing my train of thought. Just because there's, there's all these. Like, I'm guessing the base is always five. And I guess that means it's never more than than five. And this, so these numbers are weird. Fifty-three. Um, and challenges. I don't think. Yeah, you know, we need twelve to unlock challenges. And here it is. Look, we can get one. We can get another factor shift. Or after infinity, of course. So, base four. And yeah, doesn't this require yeah e100 ordinal points? So that's a that, we still have any. Yeah, this is gonna, this is gonna be op once we get this. It's gonna yeah look at this. We can literally go straight to omega squared, and omega cubed is not in much longer. I like that this is literally just incrementing. And yeah, already e11, already e13. I'm just gonna click max all because there's. I'm glad there's a max all button. This really helps. I can quickly get to E30, and I can get all this as well. And unfortunately, E100 is gonna take a, a little while, but it's, it's not gonna be that bad. So this really this is pretty OP. Just the, the whole getting the, the the ordinal point or the, the each factor is twice as powerful for this OP. So yeah, hope you enjoyed. Peace out.